Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. This is Force with some more Heroes of the Storm. Today I'll be playing as Val. I figured it's been a few weeks since we played everyone's favorite demon hunter, so why not return and play her again? We're going to be picking up Rancor here. Uh, gives us uh, increased attack speed. We're pretty much going to be doing the same, same build that I did in the uh, build video. The uh, always strafe and build video that you saw. The general premise, if you didn't happen to watch that, is that we are going to be reducing our cooldowns, uh, going for fast attack speed with some self-heal as well, I believe. Yeah, most likely. And um, and then just have strafe pretty much at every single uh, major engagement. Uh, so that's, that's going to be the game plan. Let's see how it all works out. Um, so they definitely changed things up with this. I am dead, almost. Uh, they definitely changed things up. It, I know the heroes look smaller than I remember in the past. I talked about this in my last video. The heroes looks a little bit smaller, like the camera's a little zoomed out. And it looks like they name, changed the nameplates. Now, I haven't been keeping up on things since the last patch, so I, there's pr that information is, may already be like widely known one way or the other. Um, but I just... I'm just voicing from someone who has played this game a ton and then noticed a difference. There, there's no like, it, it probably says right in the patch notes. Although I, I perused over them and I didn't notice anything of the like, but I could have just straight up missed it. But it definitely feels like the camera's again zoomed out a little bit. A um, little bit more than I recall. Either way, uh, whatever's changed, if even if it is just the nameplates, I like the way it looks. I, I like this, I think it looks sharp. I'm pretty, pretty much digging it. We got Chen on both teams. Expect Chen to be played a lot. I mean, you know, every time there's a brand new hero, you just see everyone and their mother playing it every single match for a while. And then it usually tails off and you get a more steady balance of everything. I'm going to go ahead and turn in our coins right now. Really surprised didn't drop that in the smoke. That's really the best place to do it. Just so you can see, you know, if anyone's coming or whatever. All right, we're going to hop in lane, soak up some XP. Um... So that we don't fall too far behind here. We got, I mean, we've got no one top, so they're going to start going above us if we don't. Nope, visible right there. Can't do that. In fact, they might try to... Yep. I was going to say they might try to sneak up on me or whatever. Okay, good. I got a friend here too now. Illidan, I'll be fine. All right, now we're gonna pick up a uh, Vampiric Assault. So we get heal with our basic attacks, especially when we get increased attack speed. This makes us uh, able to survive a lot of 1v1 matchups, which is nice. Guys, we're falling super behind the XP war here because we've had no one. All right, well, I'm just gonna stay top now because we got other people in the middle, so. And I'm going to push back here so that if he tries, uh, if we get... Oh, never mind. He's in the mid. I was going to say, if the Zeratul tries to come sneak behind me or whatever, I would... Um, I think I can 1v1 him. I think this is a matchup that I can win, especially with my self-heal. You can see as he was running away, that's clearly the case. I would have, if he stayed much longer, I would have taken him out. All right, we're going to grab this. Got to be careful for Zeratul, though. I mean, so, once you play this game enough, you learn to be able to tell. Oh, Zeratul's there. Finally. Came the last moment. Please, thank you very much. Totally fine with it. One for one, I can live with. I can live with a one for one. Obviously, it's better to two for one or not die at all, right? But I can live with a one for one. Um... I also, I think I also expressed this in the last video, I don't like the new look for the Merc camps. I thought it was much more clear, much more visually obvious, uh, the way it was before. These little banner icons, I don't, I just, I, I don't quite like it as much. Uh, the, the icons for these camps, the little flags, those are cool. That's alright, but, I don't know, I thought things were just a little more clear in the past. Alright, this one, we're gonna get battle momentum. This is the cooldown reduction. That allow that makes it so that our um, our cooldown abilities, including our ultimate, are off cooldown very often, especially with our increased basic attack speed. You can see how those things sort of work together. Now we're gonna go mid for some additional XP. Actually, he might try. To, they might try to gank him here. Yeah. 
We could have done a number. I doubt we would have been able to kill him. Actually, maybe now. Gonna push this a little bit. Well, yeah, I should go mid. We, we, it's, 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 it's definitely best to. I stayed there as long as I did because I wasn't sure if he was about to get ganked because I did see Zeratul with him. But it looks like that's not happening right at this moment. So, right, how are they doing down there? There's three of them down there. They're fine. They don't need my help too. So this is good. We're getting uh, XP from the lanes and. Once I push this back, I think we're going to go for the night camp. They seem to be doing okay. Actually, never mind. Let's grab this. I was about to leave for night camp, but... Okay, let's go. Do it. There we go. Sexy. Come on. Shit. Whatever. Let's help with this stuff. Come on, come on. Oh, okay. All right, good, good. They got the kill. Um, they should probably retreat now. Shoot. All right, now we're going to be picking up Strafe, our ultimate ability. Oh, good, good. Yes, there's his ultimate. Yes, they're going to get that kill. Chen's gonna peace out after that. Perfect, perfect, perfect. I wanna go for Merc Camp. They are turning in right now. They only have one dead, though. So maybe I should go help. Alright, he wants to Merc, he wants to Merc Camp with me? Sure. Take care of the ones that are on him here. He, you see, he just sets. This is why. This is why I think Chen's pretty cool because he can tank like that and then just chug down his shield thing, and you know he's he's good to go. He's ready to rock. That worked out well. I'm gonna go push top lane, or maybe I'll go mid. Hopefully they don't see me. Ah, almost snuck out in time. They did see me though. All right, let's see if we might get an engagement here. I've got my ultimate ready, so I am totally down. Oh, this is good for us. This is very good for us. I'm gonna wait to pop my ultimate. I don't need it right now. Okay, now we're gonna pop it. Because he's gonna kill me. Yep. Now, the thing is, he, he with his basic attacks, with his ultimate, he stays on your butt. So I wasn't really able to get away with him. This has been a pretty action-packed game. Like, I've died a few times. A lot, actually. But uh, we've been getting a bunch of kills, too. So this has been going pretty well. I'm having a having a good time right now with this match. That is, really blows. Holy crap. Holy crap. Wow. Alright. Um do what we can here. Oh please. dead again oh my god kill him <laughs> he's getting me all right we're gonna go with a giant killer for increased damage against heroes <laughs> that freaking dude it just sticks on my butt and it doesn't matter i vault and then he just blinks right on top of me you serious yeah well they probably could have killed taronda all right, so we're gonna be recapping this over here. Um, I would say go for the boss, but it's a little bit risky since the whole enemy team is up. Um, what the hell? All right, yeah, we didn't take that much damage, so I guess that's fine. Okay, no one's going to turn in. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go defend against this because this is a really you know what, like shitty push. That's the split up Chen. I was really confused for a minute because I hadn't seen that um I hadn't seen that animation yet. I was like, wait a second, what's going on? Wait, what is going on? Oh, he's dying, alright. And he's dying, alright. I need to get out of here though. Whoa, you can see me through shit? What are you doing? 
All right. Well, I can self heal with attacking, so we're gonna do that. You gotta be very, very careful though, because Zeratul will just come and blow me the f up. I've got my strafe, and I think now we have an opportunity to use it. He's dead, so that's fine. Are you kidding me? Alright, no need for strafe, so we don't use it. We save it if we can. And now it looks like it's gonna be a turn to turn in doubloons. So let's go over here. Uh, it's either gonna be stone skin or blood for blood. Blood for blood is really good. Um, stone skin's a little bit. I don't know, it's a tough call, actually. Blood for Blood is best with a lot of high health targets. They don't have a ton of those. I guess they've got Arthas. I'll go for Blood for Blood. Speak of the devil. I'll use my Blood for Blood now. Well, that's annoying that that just saves him like that. Alright. Whatever, he's not the only hero that has a uh, thing that sort of does that functionally. Saves him from immediate death. And that's a full turn in, good. I'm going to go defend and potentially gank. Nice. Oh, he got this thing? Alright, sweet. Alright, they might be going for the boss right now, actually. It's possible. In fact, I think they might be. I think they might be bossing right now. Yep. Nice. Alright, do we really want to go for this? This is really dangerous. I've got my blood for blood, so I guess... I guess we'll do this. This is really dangerous, though. I mean, we do have a lot of damage. And I should not have set in that. That was really stupid. You're just getting rooted, especially when you're like, it's a kind of a scary situation. Like, you don't know if someone's about to walk up and blow your face up. Yeah, be care it's being careful to get rooted. Or try to avoid getting rooted, I suppose, is what I want to say there. Is he to the hand? No, of course not. He's a Gaslo. What am I thinking? Uh, let me soak experience mid. Uh, Gazlo is going to go get Merc Camp down there, most likely. If I were to guess. Oh no, he's going to defend against the Merc Camp. I see. I see. Well, while he does that, I can probably grab this camp back here. Because he has no problem with this. Um, and the entire enemy team is up there defending against that. So. That Arthas was also there, and they just got a crap ton of coins, huh? Yeah, I think he realized. It just, extending that far is super dangerous. You try to avoid, you know what I mean? And he, he, he realizes that, which is why he said, you know, it's usually just, been, like, let, let the things push and whatever. All right, this thing's about, I'm going to help him just to expedite this process. Just let him know to be careful. Oh, no, he's, please don't. Please not everyone die right there while we're going for this. That'd be awful. Okay. This is not ending well. Let me try to go. I'm gonna be a little bit late to actually be helpful. Yeah. Oh, he's getting away? Okay. Alright. Sweet. Good. Perfect. Perfect. What an escape tool, huh? Excellent. Excellent. That worked out. That's fine. Alright. They're about to turn in a bunch of coins, but we don't have the uh, manpower to actually stop that. It would just be death for us. We've got a nice night camp push going down over here. That they're going to have to defend against. Let's see if we can pick off some stragglers. If there are any, that'd be picked. Doesn't look like it. They're defending against the night camp now, so maybe we just push this stuff back. Or what? I don't know. Chen's got that. Did he seriously just walk into a suicide again? No, okay. For a second I thought our Arthas walked into a, uh, a death trap. And they're gonna be all over there, just pinging for warnings, basically. Just 
Just to be like, hey, heads up, they are likely to be there any second now. In fact, they are mid right now. I'm running, but this is not good. It's not good. Yes! Oh ho ho ho! Well, that ended up working out alright. I'll take that. We've already got the volley lead. Oh, I'm an idiot. I didn't stay long enough to turn this in. Nice. I guess he's dead. Wait, are you serious? Are you fucking serious? Coming. Okay. All right, good, good, good. All right. Uh, yes, I guess so. This is risky, though. Uh, we are going to go with Vengeance for the penetrating rounds. They have got one up. Everyone's about to be up in a second. And we need to get that heck out of here. How much more time? One minute? Alright. I, I guess so. I see him. Oh shoot, coming. Here we go. Yes! Oh my gosh, so good! This guy's all split up again. Oh, he's got, like, full health. All right. We're not going to be able to do anything. That worked out more than well for us. That is fantastic. I didn't realize he was so close to dead. Oh, well. That worked out more than well for us. That was awesome. That was unbelievable, really. There's a dead dude. Okay. We're going to be backing up in a second, but... Ah, uh, this is risky, actually. No. I wouldn't mind going for a boss right now. Though. Let's go for boss. Let's go for boss. Here we go. Here goes nothing. Here goes nothing. I'm gonna go on this side, so if they come up, they're at least walking next to the tank and not blowing up my face. Um, they're making their way across the map, but they're probably gonna go for night camp first. At least they're not close enough to do anything to us. So... There you go. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So this game is going well. Let's see if we can secure it now. We got a two-level lead, so I, I, I have faith that we should be able to pull through victory. I've got strafe up again because, heck, this is the always strafe and build after all. So I best have strafe up. If we're going to be this aggressive, we better be right on his butt. So that they get hit by AoE from this stuff and whatever. This is really dangerous. In case you were wondering. I don't want to do my strife uh, yet. Oh, nice. That's hilarious. I mean, they're going to get ready to engage any second, this single minute, but... Okay, there it is. What the hell? What did he do his ultimate on? Ah, I died. I was able to get a little bit of damage off. Hopefully they finish him off. They... No, so close. Oh my gosh. So close. He doesn't even have any ammo. Nice. Is he really going to get away? That is hilarious. That is absolutely hilarious. All right, so all we need now is a final volley. Um, 
All we need is a final volley. Why did I do I? Uh, and then that's GG. In fact, this should do it. There you go. All right, GG. Thanks, guys, so much for watching. This was a fun little Heroes of the Storm match playing a game as Vela. Died a couple more times than I'd like to, but I think it was a still fairly successful game. We got 23 takedowns. We got 65,000 siege damage, 42,000 hero damage. Actually, that's the top hero damage in the game. I can just flex right here. I'm feeling pretty good. All right, thanks so much for watching, guys. I'll uh, Stay tuned. We're going to have some more Heroes of the Storm, another great game of coverage coming up here on the channel. That should be it, isn't it? I thought that's supposed to be it when I thought that's supposed to be it when they have no more buildings I guess not yeah they might have changed it in the last patch but I swear yeah it used to be the case that when there was no um when there was nothing nothing left then that would be it that would be a GG but I guess that's changed or something I don't know we might have it here though so Uh, I might die. I need to kill him. Okay, there we go. All right, there, there it is now. I'm sorry. A little preemptive call. Looks like they uh, they nerfed the cannons or something. But that is finally GG. Stay tuned. More gaming coverage coming up. More here's the storm. More of everything. Hope you have a fantastic day. I'll see you tomorrow. Keep watching, and keep owning.